Hi, it's Beth from Roots and Wings Energy, and today we're going to continue to talk about the element of fire in summer. So fire, as we've talked about, is that fun, playful, vibrant, exciting, all over the place, scattered energy that um, can be overwhelming at times and cause feelings of anxiety or panic, um, overwhelm, even burnout. So today we're going to focus on um, heart and small intestine. Heart is uh, emerging in the fire element and so is small intestine and their partners. So first we're going to work on freeing up some space for those energies to move and for you to feel more balanced. So we're going to start up here um, right below the collarbone and you're going to rub with some pretty um, deep intentional pressure. So you're moving, this is the heart, um, a heart a point associated with the heart neurolymphatic point. So right under that collarbone, just going to give a nice rub on both sides. Sometimes energy can stagnate. So we're kind of opening up some of this heart energy just by moving um, some energy here under the collarbone. You can feel really freeing and you don't realize sometimes how tight you are or how much a point hurts once you start rubbing it. Good, good. Um, you know, a few seconds is fine. And then now we're going to run run the um, small intestine point. So right along the, um, the seam here of your rib cage, where your rib cage meets your belly, you're gonna rub all in that sort of arc. And this is a small intestine point that's associated with the small intestine meridian, which has a lot to do with discernment. Um, so small intestine organ, right? It's constantly deciding nutrient waste, nutrient waste. And so that carries over to the meridian about how um, discernment is uh, coming through for you or if you're having trouble with discernment, discernment or making decisions. This small intestine area is a really nice one to attend to. So rubbing that all the way through, just freeing up space. It also just helps you with breathing room because it's right by your diaphragm. So rubbing that small intestine point can help with multiple things. Okay, so now that we've opened and freed up some energy, we're gonna keep working with those two meridians. So we're gonna go to the point at the top of your head and just down to the side of your head. And the top of the head is a heart point and the side of your head is a small intestine point. So we're working with these two meridians and this touch is very light, very light touch here, not deep like we were just doing. Just like you're resting your fingers on these spots. You're balancing heart and small intestine together. They're partners um, in the fire element. So you think of it as you're opening up for your decision making in line with your heart. And you can close your eyes if you'd like. Take some deep breaths. and just settle into that. Good. You can hold these for one minute or several minutes. Your arms may get tired, so you can always find a comfortable spot if you wanted to lean down onto a table or a desk. Good and then kind of shake out your arms if you're holding them up. And we're gonna hold one other um, uh, point for a fire. So we're gonna do one hand on the forehead and then in line with your eyebrows, we're gonna take the other hand and gently rest your hands on your head. This is, again is very light touch. And again, comfort is key. So if this feels too tiring for your arms, you can easily put them down on a table. For the sake of the video, I'm gonna keep mine up. These points correspond to the fire as a whole element. So you're working with all the meridians of fire as you hold these points, helping to calm your system and rebalance. These are really great points for bringing in, if you're having emotions of a lot of anxiety or overwhelm or whatever it is that you're working with, bring those emotions to mind as you hold these points because they are balancing as you're in the stressful emotion. 
the really nice part about it. Sometimes you just can't be positive, right? So you're just in whatever you're in and you're, you're holding these points while you're there. Some deep breaths here. And you can even bring in more breath and sound. The sound for the fire element is like a, ah. So it's a soothing sound. Ah, just like that, sort of helping calm. You can sense that the anxiety, the panic that's associated with fire. Do one more breath. Ah, good. Sometimes just that audible sound helps things relax. So now we're gonna close here with hands on your heart. Some deep breaths here. And if you can be barefoot, this is barefoot season. It's really helpful for the fire element to help ground and stabilize you barefoot on the earth whenever you can, helping to ground your energies, steady your, your space and open your heart. One more breath and we'll close there. Thank you for joining me. Bye-bye.